Good evening, fellow YouTubers, subscribers, <laughs> horror maniacs, movie freaks, well, everyone that counts. I'm glad to be back once again <laughs> with another update and another unpackaging video because I got a bunch of stuff right now. So, yeah, <laughs> let's see, I got a whole bunch of stuff here, cheap stuff, so I. <laughs> So, I have done what I said, I mean, I have been, like, taking it easy with buying movies. Even if it's hard to believe, especially when you see me, like, come with these huge packages. Uh, well, they're not huge, middle-sized packages. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but I have got some more. I don't know, I have low batteries on the camera, so I hope it will last. But, let's start with this package. And here I got some real goodies, man, really. It's a Asian Japanese cool stuff. And I bought them really cheap. I mean, I'm talking about like two two bucks a pop, like something like that. Some were, were like double the price, but they still they were worth it. Oh yeah, man, this is this is some cool stuff here. That I really want. Yeah. Okay, let's get to it. Uh, okay, the first one uh, that I got is. Into the mirror. I think it's a double disc because it's really thick. It doesn't say so, but well, uh, yeah. Into the mirror. I have never seen this movie, uh, but it says back on the back here that it's creepy and disturbing. So I mean, well, it's, I hope so. But it looks to, it looks like it could be really cool. It says like this: following in the wake of films such as. Ring, Phone, and Tale of Two Sisters. Right up my alley. I, I like those films. I love those films. Uh, this is, this, I think this will be really good. Into the Mirror. Well, I waste too long time on that one. Uh, then we have Full Time Killers. I think I've seen, yeah, I've seen this before. I think it was quite good. No, almost every one of these are like tar tartan Asian extreme movies. So. Yeah, and then we got Takeshi Miike movie, The City of the Lost Souls. Really cool. Cool stuff right here. Um, awesome stuff. I got these, uh, like I said, I got these movies really cheap. I mean, I'm really happy to get these movies for that price. Uh, then we got a movie that's called Breaking News uh, by Yoni2. Yoni I think I have some other movies. It's made by the same director. Oh, the, the same director of that did the full time killer did this movie. Yeah, I thought I recognized that name. That's breaking news. Yeah, that was long. And then we have lots of more. I mean, here we have uh, another public enemy. And I have the first one on Swedish release that I enjoyed really much. That that was a really serious. Like, Awesome movie, and I, I, li I, I liked it a lot. I, th I hope this will be as good as the first one. It looks promising. I hope so. Uh, yeah, and then we got uh, another one here uh, Wishing Stairs. I think this is part of a trilogy with, with movies such as uh, Memento Mori and like, what was the other one called? I don't, I don't remember, but I think there were two things. This <laughs> three movies and I think this is like the, the, the last one of them so but uh, Wishing Stairs it's like a haunting movie I mean I think it's it, it looks promising it looks really good it looks like it has a like a creepy scary atmosphere and, and such so yeah so yeah let's move on <laughs> uh, now we have a, another uh, Takashi Miike movie uh, Visitor Q. Yeah, what more can I say? It's it's Takashi Miike. Cool stuff. Got lots of more. Here's another one, Takashi Miike. Shinjuku Triad uh, Triad Society. Sorry about the glare from the <laughs> from the plastic. Uh, I have like a new light that's shining on me right now because you know my videos get so dark. But let's continue. Yep, another Takashi Miike movie, Mafia. Strange, weird, fucking shit. 
Uh, yeah, I saw a clip of this on, on YouTube that one of my fellow YouTubers put up. And it was the eye poking scene. The old lady that, that poked the eye out. Real cool stuff. Yeah, and then, well, another friend of mine on YouTube, uh, <laughs> which I'm mm, really sorry that I don't remember who it was. Mm, but there were one that had this in his collection. He also had lots of other Asian cool stuff. And he had, and he recommended this movie. Save the Green Planet. So I finally got it. I mean, I, I've been wanting to have it ever since I saw it, the video that he made. So Save the Green Planet looks awesome. Two disc special edition. All of these movies has so far been t Tartan, Asian Extreme movies. So, uh, I mean, that's all. <laughs> Get that many. Oh, but it's not all in the package. I have one more thing. Flatfoot. Bud fucking Spencer. I love that man. He, he's like a... The way he is, that's the way every real man is supposed to be. He's one of my idols. That's what I'm saying. Bearded, big, strong, and you know, don't take the fucking bullshit, but he's really nice and friendly as well, but I mean, he's really... Yes, got, he got... I don't know what to say, but his personality is something that <laughs> I like watching. But even if it's just a character, but it's cool. Well, Flatfoot, 4-disc uh, edition, 4-disc uh, collection, 4 <laughs> movies. Flatfoot in Africa, Flatfoot goes to East, and Flatfoot, and Flatfoot in Egypt. So I think it's really cool. It goes well with my other Bud Spencer and Terra Seal boxes, which I love. I mean, I love these kinds of movies. I mean, this is like, I get really happy of watching these old 70s and 80s movies because I watched this when I was a these movies when I was a kid was a kid. <laughs> so I'm getting excited right now. I can't speak all day. So well but this is awesome cool stuff. I'm, I'm looking forward to watch that movie. Well let's move on to the next package. Which I can't show you everything in it because these are the last DVDs that I, that I have gotten for my swap with Jonathan, my dear buddy. YouTube DVD Collector Series 79. Uh, yeah. E Let's move on here. <coughs> so I can't show you those, but I can show you what, what I got. I got some more you know, cool stuff here. Okay, uh, the first one that I got is uh, another one John Boo movie. Uh, one, Once a Thief. Real good movie. I love these Young Moon movies, Chow Yun Fat movies, every one of them, so I got that one. Uh, then let's move on to. Uh, mm. Yeah, here. Here we got another Young Moon movie, uh, A Better Tomorrow, the first part. I've gotten the two other ones, but I know they are good. I love all of these Young Moon. Uh, uh, Hong Kong movies, like when it when it come to when he came to America, I mean, I have to say that the movies that he started making, well, he did a couple of few that were really good, but then, no, I, lo I love his old movies the, the most. He's still a good director, but I mean, he's not as good as he was before. So, well, that's one. Uh, Bruce Lee collection, five movies. The Big Boss, Fist of Fury, Way of the Dragon, Game of Death, The Tower of Death. It's uh, pretty cool, but it's like a slim collection pack. Yeah. Honestly, cool stuff. Then I can like get rid of some, some of my other Bruce Lee DVDs. So. Uh, yeah, and here's another one that I got. Uh, uh, Dark Real. That's another, like, psychological slasher movies I think <laughs> I haven't watched this yet so but I know known of it, of it earlier and a friend of mine downloaded it but I mean I didn't want to see it I wanted to get it so but it looks like it could be a cool like horror movie well I got it real cheap so I'm happy about that uh, then I got this one that I already have but I have it on, on like a split DVD with another movie so I got pin, and uh, I quite, it was this, it was quite an interesting story. I have to say, I mean, it wasn't bad. It was quite a good movie. 
the pin. Yeah. So there we got two two versions of this one. Uh, yeah. Uh, and then also I got <laughs> Ghost, which isn't like yeah. It's not like the other movies that I got <laughs> extreme and, and horror and shit. So it's. But I like this movie. I like Ghost. I mean, fine, it's, a, it's a fine fucking early 90s movie. I mean, in the end of... I can still feel the 80s vibe in it. Absolutely. There's still some 80s in it, even if it was released in, or, in, or made in the 90s, the early 90s. But, yeah, I, mean, I like it. I think it's cool, Ghosts. I'm not much for love stories of that, but I think that's, that movie is quite wonderful. So, well, here we got another one, <laughs> a funny one, old one, Weekend at Bernie's. So I got this real shit, I mean, I like the old, all of these comedies, uh, old, like, 80s uh, comedies and such. This was released 89, <laughs> I think. So, yeah, but funny shit. So, I got a whole lot there. Uh, and then these last few I can't show you because there are, well, for my swap, but, well, I have to close this lid here, then we'll get down here, and then yeah, I'll have another package. But I know this isn't movies, but I still gotta open it. Uh, God damn it, I forgot something. I think I will save this for later on, because I got some more movies that I picked up this weekend. I went to the local second-hand store, uh, uh, look what I got. I mean, I got, I got even more movies. First of all, uh, I got The Simpsons, the first season, for like 20 Swedish crowners, and that's like, you, you know how much that is? That is like uh, two American dollars, two bucks. I got it for two bucks. Less than two bucks, even. Less than two bucks, it's 1.6 dollars or something like that. And <laughs> get down it. So I got that one, and I get that one for the same price. Uh, analyze that, this. It's really cheap, so what the hell. Uh, the Brothers Grimm, which I already have, but uh, my edition is unfortunately without a, a case or a front cover, so I think I will give that to my brother and keep this one. So yeah, The Brothers Grimm. Uh, Kelly's Heroes, awesome good war movie, as you know. Uh, and I got this one, no one can, uh, I don't know how to, to really like... Uh, translate this into English, but no one can love like us. I think something like that would, would be. Ingen kan älska som vi. It's one of the first, is, it, I think it's actually, actually is the first Isabella Skorupko movie that she made when she was 17 years old. I don't know if I will keep this one, but I just thought that I wanted to see it again because I know that I saw it way back, like when it came out. Not when exactly when it came out, but in the end of the 80s or something, I, I saw it and I, I actually enjoyed it. I mean, I don't think I feel the same way. It's, it hasn't been a favorite of mine or something, but it's interesting. So I, I will watch it and then if I don't want to have it, then I will get rid of it. Uh, and I got, I got these from a few other places. So first, like these two I got from one of my grocery stores here where I live. It's a two disc special edition of Into the Wild. Uh, this collect collector's edition, not special. There's nothing special about it except that it's a good movie. Into the Wild, two disc edition, real great movie. Uh, yeah, that's a good one. Uh, then, then I got from the same place I got, which I get. I'm going to, I'm going to get this uh, another time in another version, and maybe for Blu-ray or something because I really like this movie. It's uh, the new Rambo movie. Young Rambo or Rambo 4 or whatever you want to call it, but it's so fucking gory and so fucking brilliant. I love this movie. Uh, I mean, I just I have I have had it before, but I, but I gave it away. I don't know why I did it because it, they I wasn't well. It wasn't in the best shape. I mean, it was 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 watchable, but now I got with a suitcase and I no special features or anything. But it, but it, I just gotta have it in my collection, so I will get it again later on. And then in another place I got these two movies for the same price as the other ones. So I got the Proposition. Proposition. I mean, yeah, cool. Then I got The Singing Detective. So yeah. 
quite quite a bunch of movies, yeah, I want to say. That's cool. Now let's move on to this package of it. And the, these are movies. So yeah. Sorry about that, but, but I mean let's open it to show me what 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 other stuff that I enjoy as well. Yeah. First I didn't think everything was in here, but it was. So what I got is manga. Because I collect manga, and what I like is old school manga, you know, really old. And this is the same. <sighs> like a while back ago, I showed you one of my favorite anime movies, and it was Barefoot. Oh, uh, it's actually two movies in a, in a box set of two. So, but it was Barefoot again. And now I got the manga Barefoot again. So yeah, I love that stuff, old old manga, I mean it's really cool. This is this is culture in a high level. I mean I love the way they draw, I mean this is feeling, this is like this is like heart, I mean this is like and most of them has their own style and they're, and they're not afraid to like show it. They're, there's no fear. Like today many just like they want to like keep it the same style and you know they fall into a like a form I don't like that. Uh, I mean, it's, it's important to make your own mistakes as an artist because the mistakes is also a part of your style. So it's very important to keep some of your mistakes that you're making in the comic to make it alive. But it's up to you to choose which ones you want and which ones, ones you don't have. But it's important because I, all of these old ones, they have it. They, re they really do. I don't know because I've been analyzing and thinking about it <laughs> ever since I was a kid. And that's what I like about them. So I got three parts of Barefoot, Barefoot again. Mm, love this, this stuff. And then I got some other, like, I never read this, Bao, Bao, I don't know how to pronounce it. B-H-O-H, Bao. What did I say? <laughs> One, uh, did I spell it wrong? But, ah, who cares? But it's also like a, like a more old school manga, you know? Black and white, uh, like rough steel pen. I mean, they don't hide their style; they just go with the flow. Yeah, I love that stuff. So, so th uh, this is one another one of my interests. I also buy comics, uh, not as much, but it ha happens every once in a while. Uh, but I don't almost only like old manga, but uh, some new. But I'm really picky about what I want to read. So, you know, but but I, uh, this is cool. So I got a bunch of those. Bow. Uh, it's like one, two, three, six of them. So, yeah, I don't this kind of those anymore. But yeah, so get down of what the whole hole I made. Yeah. Eh. Can't the camera out of. Uh. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, I don't know if you can see, but it's probably pretty dark down there. Let me just get my fucking light here. I'm sorry for swearing that much. No, no, some of you won't, maybe don't like that, I don't know. Mm. This is a long video, <laughs> but I mean, it was some time ago I made it the last one, so yeah. That is all the DVDs that I got, and I mean that is uh, quite a few. That is a bunch, you know. Uh, can't even grab them all with my hand. So that is quite a lot. I mean, I, I don't care. Forget about it. Th what I'm going to say, <laughs> say and show is that under this blanket. This is the package that I'm going to send to my dear old friend, um, Sir DVD collector Sir 79. So I packed it and prepared. There's only like a couple of DVDs that I'm going to put down there and then I'm going to like ship it. So I will be doing that uh, I think tomorrow because I need to eat. That's the first package. And I know that I told uh, my friend Spanish Germ 669 that I sent his package but I, didn't I really didn't do that because things came up. But I packed it and it's right here. This is the package that he's going to get. I hi I'm I'm hi hiding them under the blanket because I don't want to show the package how they how to look and th things like that. So, but it, it, I mean, I, hopefully, I mean, you think it's well, I think it's a little fun to just know that 
what lies beneath this blanket is your package that you're going to get. So I mean, isn't that fun? I think it's fun. So well, I think that's all I have time for this time. But my fellow YouTubers, yeah, I'll see you around later. Take care of my buddies. I will make more videos really soon. See you.